Hey everybody, I'm Amy from Body Fit by Amy and this is your kettlebell 10 minute quick hit workout. So in this workout, we will use one kettlebell to work your entire body for strength and cardio in just 10 minutes. I will give you lots of options, so listen to your body and work to your fitness level. All you need for this workout is one kettlebell. I'll be using my 15 pound kettlebell today. Are you ready? Let's do it. Okay, so start just by marching or jogging, roll those shoulders. It's a quick workout, so we are not gonna do very much of a warm up. If you need more of a warm up, get it on your own, but we're gonna try to keep this just 10 minutes, but we will take a quick minute or so to get everything moving and warm. Reach across. Here's what we're doing, guys. We have 10 moves, a lot of them are compound moves where we are getting upper and lower together and some of them will be moves without the kettlebell that are going to be more of our hit our high intensity cardio getting that heart rate up it's all going to be cardio it's all going to get your heart rate up the only thing we're going to repeat is that fifth and tenth move is going to be your kettlebell swing everything else is no repetition go ahead and grab your kettlebell we're going to start just with a little lunge curl over your hip and here, here we go. Lunge, curl. So it's a little cross curl. You're still gonna get low in the lunge. So I'm crossing over the knee that's in the front to get my core engaged. If you wanna twist a little more, you can. It's gonna throw your balance a little bit. That's okay. And breathe. Here we go. Keep it going. If you want, you can just keep the upper with a little step cross or just keep that curl down in the front a little less range of motion if you don't want to twist 10 seconds curl and up and breathe yes last one good drop it down i'm going to step into that transverse side lunge heel up i'm going to do a row at the back press through hand it off step out row Join me here, here we go, 45, step out, row, push out of the hip, switch hands, here, row, and switch. So I'm moving at the diagonal, but it is just your regular side lunge. So if you need to go here, if that feels a little better, that's okay. Yes, keep it going, over halfway there. And breathe. Stay low. Transverse. And up. Five seconds. Can you get one more each way? I think you can. Yes. I know we went a little over. Put it center. Little bit of cardio, guys. So tap and up. Tap and up. Or step and up. Step. Here we go. So regular, a little higher impact. You're getting low in that squat, reaching up, or step out, reach up. Either way, our third move here is gonna get that heart pumping, right? Down, down, yes, breathe, good, there we go. I know, little leg burn, right? Don't worry. We got core coming. Breathe. 10 seconds to go. So we got compound, compound, cardio, no weights, and then some core. Breathe. Last one. Good. Down on your knees, guys. It's a bear plank. Put that kettlebell out in front where you have to reach for it. Lift up in that bear plank. Taps, taps. You can go down in between or keep those knees down the whole time. Here we go. Taps. If you need to modify, just do the reach and engage in that core or up, down, up, down, or tap, lift. I know, so many options. Just pick one. You're lifting those knees off using that core and then do that reach to put you off balance just enough. We're gonna get that core working as well as some upper body so we're keeping it 
we will keep it a compound movement. Remember, you can bring it down in between. 10 seconds. Breathe or hold it up. Last five, four, three, two, and breathe. Bring it up. 15 seconds to breathe. Kettlebell swing. If you've never done a swing, make sure you check out my how to do a swing video. And if you want, modify here with a little deadlift, just a hinge. Everybody else, join me here. Hike it, three, two, one, power it up. So it's back loaded. I'm keeping it chest level or below. My arms are not working. They're getting the benefit, but they're not lifting. It's all through here. Lock out on the legs, glutes, core, and back. And again, if you need to modify or you need a little breather, take it here. Deadlift, bring it up. Deadlift, bring it up. Here we go. Keep it up. I know it's a long time to swing. 10 seconds to go. Yes, three, two, one. Relax, pedal those feet. Yes, there we go. Whew. Bring it back up with your kettlebell. Watch me here. This time we're gonna curtsy, twist all the way up. Join me, twist all the way up. So kind of similar to that lunge, but we're gonna cross it in the curtsy by the hip, press. By the hip, press, yes. Yes, there we go. Down and up. All the way up. If it's starting to slide, grab that bell or hold the handles, whatever feels better for you. Here we go. And up. And up. Yes. Good. Five. Four. Three. Two. One. Relax. Low windmill or high windmill. We're going 20 seconds each side. We'll switch in between. Take it up here if you want. Here we go. So low if you need to. If you can keep it high, the hurry should be up, right? And breathe. Yes. Good. Drop it down. Bring it up. Three, two, one. You got five seconds to switch. Again, take it low if you want or high. Here we go, 20 seconds. Down and up, toe out. Lift that hip out. So we're getting shoulder, shoulder girdle. Lots of stretch on the way down and lots of oblique. I know we're getting our core in early. Breathe and reach and up. Good, last one and relax. All right, team, kettlebell in the center. So it's your cardio. We're gonna pop it back, push it up if you want, pop it up and touch. Ready, here we go. Pop it back, push it up, pop it in and touch. Stay low, you can walk it back too. Knees if you need to, walk it in and touch. Or here to the knees, push up here. Walk it in and touch. Any of those options will do. We just want to get that heart rate up, right? We got core coming and then we got that swing one last time. So keep it going. Totally fine. I don't have a lot of range of motion on my push up because of a bad shoulder. So take it to that knee if you need to. Pop it back. Breathe. Five seconds to go. What do you got? And up and tap down on your back, guys. All right, watch me here. So we got a little press and in, down and down. If you want to, just keep the press or just the crunch. Here we go. Up, tuck the chin, little crunch, in and down. Up, in and down, take it up. Up, good, and breathe. Up, let me show you one more right here. Triceps, press, every other one is up, crunch, and trice. Up, 
crunch and chest. Up to you, 10 seconds. Again, if that feels like too much, just do the crunch or just do the press or tries. There we go. Good guys, last move of the day. One more time with your swings. Hinge with that deadlift. If you don't have experience with the swings or if that feels like too long or take breaks in between, ready, here we go. Hike it back, prep it up, power it up. Again, I don't do a lot of timed intervals unless it's a workout like this or short to body intervals with swings because it's long. But again, if you need to swing, take a little stretch break, come right back into it or hinge with your deadlift. Same set of muscles, we're just taking the power out of it. Here we go, whatever you feel comfortable with. Keep it going. Last move of the day. So we got a lot of upper, a lot of lower, a lot of core, a lot of cardio. Let's go five, four, three, two, one. Let it swing and relax, pedal your feet. Whoo, let your head and neck relax. Good work, team. Whoo, shake that out. Little stretch to those legs, slowly roll it up. Swing those arms. Quick sip of water if you need it. There you go, guys. 10 minutes getting it all in. You know me. I have a lot of quick workouts on this channel. Check them out. I have a playlist of 10 minutes of five minutes. You don't have to commit an hour or 45 minutes. I have some longer workouts on here too, but you can get it all in in a short amount of time. Check out all of my playlist. You will find more 10 minute, more dumbbell, more kettlebell, all different types of equipment and types of workout by body part, prenatal, postnatal. And then of course, check the links in the description below and you can find information on my eBooks and programs if you're looking for more of a curated schedule routine to go with these videos. And check out my nutrition guide. It's not a diet, no counting calories, just building a balanced plate, enjoying food. That's what we're about. Whew. And of course, if you like this workout, don't forget to subscribe. Subscribing helps me keep making completely free videos for you. So hit that subscribe button, turn on your notifications. You'll always know when I have new videos. Big deep breath in. Thank you so much for showing up today. If you showed up, you are successful. That was your kettlebell 10 minute quick hit workout. Great job, everybody.